Don in London, hello. July 12th, my video is all about recovery from either addiction to substance or behaviour. My addictive substance, alcohol, my behaviour equally addictive. People, places, things, work, relationships, you name it, trying to fix myself in some way. And these days, trying not to fix myself in some way on a daily basis, just remain in recovery, right-sized, human-sized. And what helps me is the fellowship of AA, Alcoholics Anonymous. I do not speak for AA, I speak for myself. And we need more than one voice, the voice of many, in order to find our own path of recovery. I share here the daily reflections from AA, one page a day, just to give some support when we cannot get to meetings or as an adjunct or supplementary to meetings. So for today, it says here, giving up centre stage, July 12th. For without some degree of humility, no alcoholic can stay so sober at all. Without it, they cannot live so much, so to much purposeful. I'll say that again. Cannot live to much useful purpose, or in adversity, be able to summon the faith that can meet any emergency. So life in recovery is the good and the bad, and living with both, and experiencing what we can and cannot do. Why do I balk at the word humility? and I'm okay with it now. I am not humbling myself toward other people, but toward God, which is for me the truth, love and wisdom of others, as I understand him. Humility means to show submissive respect, and by being humble I realize I am not the center of the universe. In other words, I'm still learning the truth, understanding what is love, and getting wisdom from others. When I was drinking, I was consumed by pride and self-centeredness. I felt the entire world revolved around me, that I was master of my destiny. Humility enables me to depend more on God to help me overcome obstacles. That's finding the truth, understanding love and the wisdom of others. To help me with my own imperfections, so that I may grow spiritually. I must solve more difficult problems to increase my proficiency, and as I encounter life's stumbling blocks. I must learn to overcome them through God's help. Daily communion with God demonstrates my humility and provides me with the realization that an entity more powerful than I is willing to help me if I cease trying to play God myself. So having removed myself from the God equation, I can open myself up to the truth rather than my own opinion and belief and find love and wisdom from others. So the serenity prayer, which helps me when I cannot connect in some way or other to what is going on in reality, is this. God, to God or good conscience, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. Courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference is just for today.